dog hair on my face. So what do you do if you can't afford the most recent or updated or even the best quality of gear, specifically cameras, lenses, lights, whatnot? I wanna see if you can guess the price of the total package that I use today to create this scene. And then I wanna go over gear, money, costs, and what are my thoughts on that kind of thing and how I can help beginners. Hey babe, I'm taking Victoria to the orthodontist, all right? I'll see you in a few. Can I drive? 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 Anything. Daddy. No. Daddy. Daddy. Time to go. I hope you enjoyed watching that as much as I enjoyed making it. Uh, that kind of stuff is always fun. It's a fun time to just make something silly and dumb sometimes. It's not for work. Uh, but I'm going to give you three seconds or four seconds to determine how much did that package cost. The film, the lens, everything that was used. And then I want you to put it in the comments. And now I'm going to tell you uh, what I filmed it with was this. Uh, this is the Olympus EM1 Mark II that is $400. Uh, that's how much I paid for this thing and the lens that I used is the Helios 44 which I paid $50 for and I did didn't use any lights I used my window um, and the tripod that I used is actually the one I'm holding now it's the Mantis Pod 2.0 so all in to make something of that quality which I know it's not winning any awards I understand that I made it in less than an hour um, but I used a $400 camera a $50 lens and no lights with, I think I paid $55 for the Manus Pod 2.0 on Amazon. Um, now I did have an adapter for the lens. It's, you could get the Viltrox dummy adapter. They have speed boosters and they have adapters. The, the adapter is super cheap. I don't know how much, but all in all, we're looking at under $550 to make something like that. Now the one thing I wasn't including in that is this mic. Hollyland Lark M2 that I've been using. Um, and I'm not including that because I didn't need to use it. I accidentally just left it on from when I was talking on the camera. Um, I had planned on using a shotgun mic, but by the time I finished the first scene and realized that I'd already captured some audio with this, I'm gonna keep it. But with a shotgun mic, something like a Rode Video Mic Go, you're looking under 600 bucks. And it films 4K, it's wonderful. I've used it on a lot of paid projects and no one ever knows the difference once you put it on the screen. So how low can you go? You can go very low and that's just like a, a law of diminishing returns. You know, there's a certain point at, I also filmed one shot with my cell phone, um, but there's a certain point at like where returns just start getting lower and lower the more you spend. So if you spend 400 bucks for this camera, or you spend, what, 1500 bucks for this Lumix I'm on, or if you spend $3,000 on an FX3, well, how much quality difference are you really getting? And the point I wanna make though, with filming with something so cheap, and you're gonna see a lot of this on my channel, because I always wanna enable people to chase their dreams and do what they wanna do, especially with filmmaking. Um, but the point of it is I don't want you to have any excuses 
to not be making stuff. If your excuse is I don't have a camera, I don't have a good lens, I don't have a Sony FX3, I don't have the A7S III, I'm gonna be honest with you, those are just excuses. Take whatever camera you have and start making stuff, even if it's your phone. Plenty of people make really cool stuff on their phones. The point is to get out there, just start making stuff. Kind of like I'm just starting this YouTube channel. I know a lot of you don't know me, um, but I've been doing full-time filmmaking for about a decade now and have just recently decided to start YouTube. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's more difficult than I thought it would be, so I got a lot of respect for the people who do this so much. Um, it's a whole different challenge filming yourself doing stuff than it is filming others uh, like on a set or something. Uh, but it's been fun. I'm excited about the journey of it. Um, but no excuses. All right. No excuses today, tomorrow, the next day. If you want to do this, if you want to make videos, if you want to get paid to make videos, if I can do it, anyone can do it. You don't need the best equipment. You can get all in for under a thousand dollars and start making money on weddings, on corporate work, commercials. Uh, almost any modern camera is plenty good to do this. As a proponent of shooting with cheap gear, uh, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope it encourages you and gives you some permission to go out here and make something even though you're not using the latest and the greatest equipment. I appreciate you tuning in and until next time, I'll see you soon.